What's up y'all? Aiden here. So today we're gonna to be making a bushcraft cooking pot out of the old can. So what you're gonna do so the tools you're gonna to need is a hammer, some nails, and you're gonna need some wire. And now it don't matter what, what what type of wire it is, as long as you can make a handle out of it and it won't melt, that's all you need. So let's get this thing started. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna have to do is you're gonna take a you're gonna have to take the lid off using a can opener, obviously, and you're gonna have to get rid of all the everything that's inside there, and. You're just gonna, after you do that, actually, you need some sandpaper. It doesn't matter, really, it doesn't, really doesn't matter what grit it is. I'm using 150 grit. And all you're gonna do is use it to get all these burrs off on the inside. So just kind of... It doesn't take a lot of sanding. Maybe like thirty seconds worth of sanding, not much. So just kind of sand all those down. Then you're gonna need some paper towel. Take it, fold it about three times, and just get all that sand from the sandpaper and the little pieces I got in there, little pieces of metal I fell down in there. Just clean those out. Don't want those in there. Make you sick. Okay, so we got that all done. So the next thing you're gonna need to do is take. Hold on. Uh, okay. You're gonna need a marker where you're gonna put the holes. So I'm just gonna. There's a little black line down the center of mine. So I'm just gonna scrape a little mark there. And on the other side. Let's scrape a mark at the same spot, just on the other side. Okay, so once you got your mark scraped out, you're just gonna take a take your nail. Oops. You gotta take your nail here and pound a hole through it. So working on that. Get it. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, sometimes you need to start out with a thin nail to start the hole. Doesn't seem to be going in. So Forget the bushcraft part. We're going to the drill press. So you don't need a big bit. Maybe a like a one eighth inch drill bit right there. That won't be a bad size. That would actually be perfect. Get that put in there. Bit. Yeah, I'll come back to you guys. Alright, so I got the holes drilled with a one eight one eighth inch drill bit. So the next thing we're gonna need to do is get some wire and run it through here so we got a nice a nice handle. 
You're gonna need to run it through the holes. Yeah. So, I'm gonna be using copper wire for this. Cause it's like the only thing I got. It's the only thing. Yeah. Oh. Uh, okay. So you're only gonna need a piece of wire about a yeah about a foot long. This is kind of some thick wire. So what you're gonna do? Is start it from the inside. Just like that. I'm gonna bring this up. Bring this up. And we're going to wrap it tight to each other. Just like that. And another thing you can do is take some pliers to make a nicer finished look. Take some pliers. Twist it. Just like that. That way you got a nicer look there. It's not all crappy and loose. Pretty tight. Okay, so the next part you're going to do is take your wire again. Put it through from the inside. Just like that. Wrap it around. Grab it with your pliers. Just like that, and pretty much done. That's all you had to do. I hope you guys liked this project. It's going to be going in my lean to fort that I built. I got a video on that. Check it out, it's pretty sweet. And subscribe, like, comment below in the comment box what you think I should do next and now see y'all later